Welcome back guys. I am Captain Billy Delph and we're in my kitchen here in Key West, Florida and we're going to be doing some really cool cooking for you guys today. We're doing a mini series on Delph fishing that's going to be dropping every Thursday. You guys have heard of farm to table. Well guess what? This is ocean to table. So let's dive right in. All right guys, this is a scamp grouper. You typically don't see these guys on the menu very often because of the depths that they're caught in. It makes them a little bit more rare, but they are the very best of all the grouper and I love the texture. Um, as I fillet this, you'll kind of see, but the meat is absolutely beautiful. And they have this, it's more than just flaky. It reminds me of a, hog, a hogfish that we catch down here uh, while we're spearfishing a lot. And uh, it has the flavor of the, one of the very best groupers out there, which is a black grouper. Um, these things, if, if you could get them, look at that. Just look at the color of the meat. It's so beautiful and has a translucence to it that you just will not see and a lot of other fish. Okay, now that we've seen those beautiful fillets, let's get started with step number one, and that is making our beurre blanc. Our beurre blanc is basically a, uh, a wine um, reduction, um, and it's a butter sauce. It's a buttercream sauce that you put together. And down here in the Florida Keys, we love key limes. So this is a green peppercorn key lime beurre blanc, and it goes so well with these fillets. Let's get started here and get the heat turned on. I'm actually gonna be doing some asparagus and um, steaming that to go with it. The boys love it. Right here, we have already pre-mixed it, but it's white wine, white wine vinegar, um, and key lime juice mixed into this. So we're gonna go ahead and mix this in right now and get it going. And we have our shallots and our garlic. So we're gonna go ahead and get that in the pan right now and let it start reducing. You're gonna wanna reduce this down to just a couple tablespoons, just about three or four tablespoons and let that reduce. What's up, Daniel? Hey, Dad. How was your trip today? Good. Yeah? What'd you guys catch? Uh, we got a uh, nice black grouper. We actually had a, a second black grouper got eaten by a shark. We only got a head, but yeah. that sucked. And Did you? Two more big ones to the bottom. Bunch of mutton snapper, tunas. Overall, it was just nonstop. So you guys happy? Yeah, it was good. That's good. It was really good. That's pretty cool. Well, we are doing a peppercorn key lime beurre blanc scamp grouper for dinner tonight. <laughs> are you hungry? That sounds amazing. Are you hungry? <laughs> Let's do it. Well, right here, we're going to let this, like I said, we're going to let this reduce right now. And we're actually going to strain it here in a second and get all these pieces and stuff because you want a very smooth sauce. So after we get that butter going in it, we're going to get all the butter fat in it and everything else. We're going to strain it right here. And then we're gonna add in our peppercorns and start bringing in our cream and everything else. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and add this to our strainer here. And we're gonna dump it through our strainer. Go ahead and put this away. Go ahead and get this out of our strainer. You want a really smooth sauce. And the only texture that's gonna be in here is gonna be the peppercorn. So I'm gonna go ahead and set the strainer to the side. And we're gonna take just a little bit here. Probably gonna take just a liberal amount. There's your peppercorns in brine solution. So they're a little salty right now as it is. <clears throat> You're gonna just add them to it. And go ahead, stir this up. And add some lemon zest right now. Excuse me, lime zest. All right guys, timing is everything when you're plating food. Let's jump right into this grouper. I got the heat on, on a new frying pan. Put a little bit of oil in this pan. And let's get right here with these fillets. So we're gonna just portion these out. And I love this stuff right here. This is the Tony Sacheri's, <laughs> if that's how you pronounce it. I've been using this stuff for a long time. Um, I love it, but we don't wanna to go too crazy with seasoning here. So we're gonna just apply a very small amount because it's a strong spicy seasoning. It has salt in it. So it really adds to the savor of the fish, which the fish needs, a little bit of salt there. And this pan is hot, I can hear the grease, and here we go. 
put it seasoning side down so it sears right into the meat. And then I'll put a little bit more seasoning on top. So when we flip it, it's going to be ready. Again, you don't want to go too heavy with this because it really is the star of the show here really is the scamp grouper. Um, this stuff, the texture is something you will never forget the first time you have it. The moment of truth. Check out this sauce here. Look how pretty this stuff looks. Guys, check that out. You can see those peppercorns in there. It is awesome, awesome sauce. So this is how you do it. You take your sauce, put a liberal amount on the plate. I don't want to overdo the fish, but I do want to be able to get some of this as we go. A couple of those peppercorns in there. Set that down. We're going to take a nice little piece of this fish. Oh, see, this is how flaky this is. It's falling apart. Woo. So delicate. Take some of this asparagus here. And let's give it a taste test, shall we? Boys, come here, try this. So, go ahead, Daniel, grab it. Check out this filet. Look how clean that breaks apart right there. Okay, go for it. Man, it's hot. Oh my gosh. You like it? Amazing. Can you taste the key lime? Mm-hmm. Oh, man. There's no fish better than scamp. Every time I have it. It's so clean. It's just a beautiful, clean white meat. And if, it just literally disintegrates in your mouth with just some really light flakiness to it. Yeah, this is amazing. This fish, I love just for the taste of the fish. You really don't have to do a whole lot to it. Just a little bit of butter sauce in there to give it a, to give it a little bit of fat to eat with it. Just trying to get it on the fork, it just falls apart. Ma'am, guys, this stuff is awesome. I hope you guys get a chance to try it. You can try it on a lot of different white meat fish, but today we are lucky enough to try it on Scamp Grouper. Guys, these episodes are part of a new series that we're doing, Catch and Cook, but it's just cooking. And we're gonna be dropping these episodes instead of on Tuesdays, like our main episodes, we're gonna be dropping them on every Thursday at five o'clock because it's five o'clock somewhere and down here in Key West, it's always five o'clock. Guys, thank you so much for joining. Please try these, try these out and let us know what you think. Um, I can't wait to hear the comments, what you guys uh, like. I've been seeing a lot of these guys with our first uh, fish taco recipe we've done. I've seen several of you guys trying it. It was made us feel so good to see people trying our recipes and Don't forget to like and subscribe guys. We're so thankful that you guys are here with us Please continue to follow us and we cannot wait to show you what we got coming on future episodes <laughs>